In this question, we need to figure out which regular polygon is going to tessellate. So again, what we're looking at is can we get uh, basically the interior angles of one of these figures to be a number that's going to have a multiple that is 360. So let's start with the pentagon. So a pentagon, what we're doing to determine that angle outside is thinking about the middle. And if we were to divide this pentagon up into, in this case, five equal triangles, uh, what would our angle measures look like from the center? Because that's going to give us this exterior one. So for the angle measure, I'm going to take 360 degrees, and I'm going to divide that by 5, because we have five triangles here. And that's going to give me an angle measure of 72 degrees. So that's the interior here. So if I'm looking at the interior angle here, then I can figure out what these would be by taking 180 degrees, subtracting off my 72, and getting 108 degrees. So both of these angles here for this triangle would be 108, which means my exterior angle is also 108. So what I want to know is, could I use multiples of 108 degrees and get to 360? And the answer to that is no. I skip right on by it go to 432. So that's not going to tessellate. Let's look at the same thing for my hexagon here. So I'll divide that by 6 and I'll get 60 degrees because again I'm talking about all these triangles inside. I'm trying to figure out what the angle is. So looking at that one single triangle, take away that 60, I'll get 120 degrees which would be split between these two angles equally or which also gives me that exterior angle. And if I count by multiples of 120, I get 120, 240, 360. So I did get a multiple of 360, which means I could take three hexagons and rotate them around a point and they'd fit really nice and tessellate. So my answer is B.